What's going on guys? In today's video I'm going to be installing this Gigabyte Wi-Fi card with Bluetooth. It's a really popular card so I decided to get it. The first thing I'm going to do, I already removed my graphics card and that's when I decided to shoot the video. Don't you just love the sound of opening new stuff? So it comes with this little CD. I actually didn't need to use this. Um, so check with your motherboard where you need to put this. If you're building PCs you should know how to do this. I'm not even sure why I'm making this video. I just like recording and making videos, but i um, just removing the plate in the back so I can fit this in. What you're gonna do, you're gonna find your little PCIe slot, snap it on in very gently. It should just snap right in at the end. Um, that little notch right there, you're just gonna line it up with the slot and then push it in. Now it should look like this. Everything should line up. The screw hole should line up nice and clean. It's very, very simple. So next thing you're going to do, get your USB plug. And there's only one way to put this in. So like I said before, check your owner's manual on where to plug this in to your motherboard. You're going to plug this into your Wi-Fi card. And the other end, guess where that's going to go? Into the motherboard where it says USB. Once again, check your owner's manual. It's really hard to screw up. I'm not sure you can plug this into a wrong spot, but I could be wrong. Um, next thing I'm gonna do, put the graphics card back in. This thing is gigantic, so I'm surprised all this fit in there. I'm just gonna put the screw cover back in. Now my graphics card's kind of slanted because as you can see, the HDMI didn't fit all the way, so I had to actually go with the um, data port cable or whatever the hell it's called can't think of it right now um, so I actually wanted it a little bit slanted down on the end so I could fit a cable in there but the next thing you're gonna do connect the antenna with the screws and this thing is really cool it's magnetic and it is as simple as that next thing we're gonna do we're going to turn on the PC look at that big old magnet you can put it anywhere you want so we're gonna turn on the PC we're gonna connect it to the Wi-Fi. Hit connect, put in my password. Let's see if it works. Oh! And the card installed all the drivers, everything it needed. As you can see right there, it's setting up the new device. It has Bluetooth on it, it has Wi-Fi and it has everything you need very very simple to install it's pretty much plug and play and it actually has an extra usb slot on the card if you need one so thank you for watching guys